guys, it's BG here and welcome back to another video of Clash Royale. And today's video, the epic chance is out. I'm kind of like late, but still, I did the epic chance like three times and I cannot just made it to nine wins. But it's so hard to just win in this challenge. But I'm at first I win like four wins, three losses, five wins, three losses. And now I'm like six with a three loss. I don't really want to play this game anymore. But I got three cards and f six skeleton armies or five. I forgot. But anyways, I'm using oh no, this one. Sorry. I'm using this deck. This is kind of like the knight graveyard and poison deck with uh, with the best supportive cards and the best building. And so it's really cheap, it's really like useful, but I cannot still reach this point. What nine epic cards? So, but anyways, let's open this chest right now. We got 600 gold, we know that. Two rocks, kind of like I like. I'm yes, I need the rocket because it's in my deck. Like, epic card, I didn't even realize that we can I can get epic cards on this one but anyways I'm gonna show you some replays with the night graveyard deck I was using so not gonna waste any time let's jump into the first show you it's against an elite barbarian deck so a lot of you guys will have problems with the elite barbarian deck. Night graveyard bowler and electro. So I'm gonna drop minions at the back. He's just sitting and wasting elixir. He maybe wasted two elixir, maybe. 
Jab an electro wizard, I drop knife and graveyard. Used it for the cost. Off this is the best defense. So the bowler and the knight is gonna take care for that really well. The archer is gonna take care for the electro wizard, but that one archer went away. So the electro wizard got one shot off, which may be 150 damage. And I'm gonna counter the graveyard with my minions. I'm gonna pull the knight with the ice spirit, but still it's not gonna help. The tornado is really bad because the tornado didn't kill my minions and the graveyard was almost finished. But still he's winning. And then I'm gonna drop the knight at the back maybe. Yes, knight at the back because I know he's he's gonna push and he's gonna use his bowler. So I'm gonna split the archers and look at this. I'm gonna push to the other lane. I pushed the other lane. Yes, I pushed the other lane and he was like mad and he don't know what to do. Look at this, he's mad and his electrons are gone now. He's just I'm just I think I took the tower. Yes, I took the tower and that was a lot of damage. But I defend that tower pretty well. I drop a knight because now I can use it because I'm winning. Now I can use my knight to defend. With this deck, if you have one tower, then you can use the knight with to defend. But other than that, you should not use it because this is your main push. So I want to split the archers again at the back. He's gonna quickly go for a graveyard poison and I am gonna try and counter it with minions and that's gonna do I'm gonna drop my poison. Now poison is the best counter for like for the what? I didn't let the electro wizard get me. So as I'm saying poison is the best counter for the graveyard. Now I'm gonna again drop the graveyard and knight because as I told you often it's the best defense. I'm gonna also poison that bitch so can get some more damage and he's gonna poison that with graveyard because he's know that he need to take the tower or else he's going he will be in a big trouble. He's gonna pull me over there but still didn't get much damage. My infernal tower is gonna take out the bowler. The 10 seconds left. He's almost going to go down. And I'm gonna win with this deck. I'm gonna drop the knight and gonna drop a troll. Graveyard defense player. That was my second replay. Again, defeating a really good deck, like a meta deck, current current meta deck. So let's jump into the third battle, which I want to show you guys. If you guys have problem against a lead barbarian rocket executioner, then you should definitely use this deck because now I'm going to, we I'm going to defend uh, what defeat this deck. He's gonna drop an execution at the back and. I'm like now I have to use my infernal tower to deal with that because I have nothing than the knight to defend that execution because execution is the best splash. And I'm gonna drop I think the infernal tower and one elite barbarian is gonna go to the tower. I'm gonna freeze that elite barbarian. I'm gonna drop the knight so the infernal tower is still alive. I don't have enough elixir for the graveyard. I didn't graveyard it. Yeah, I didn't graveyard it. Then. He's gonna do 600 damage, which is a lot. Which is a lot of damage. I'm gonna pull those skeletons over here. With like, that was really good. And now I don't have my knight to push. And he's again gonna drop the mega minion. Now I know that, and now here I know that he doesn't have any like giant or stuff, so I should not save my. for the push and he's gonna rocket the tower just like anything I sh he should drop him yes and now I'm gonna push him it's gonna be I'm gonna push the opposite lane because I need I love that he's gonna rock him I don't have enough to poison still a little bit damage still a little bit damage not enough damage like him but hey 
we did a we did take out take out his uh, main horn and now I am again back with my knight graveyard. I'm gonna drop the knight and the graveyard maybe a yeah, knight and graveyard because I don't wanna push and he's also gonna push over there. I'm gonna drop I'm gonna drop a poison over there because I don't really care if he takes the tower. trophies and I need to get the challenge over. maybe in the next season I will push to that because I don't think so I'm gonna I will be able to reach legendary arena in this season maybe or not so I'm gonna wrap up this video right now I hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like on this video and until next time I see you guys soon